We know that patients with hepatitis C really fall into really one of three major groups. Uh, patients that are sustained responders, those that have a response early in therapy and that continues through therapy and is maintained. And those are, the, those are the best, obviously. And probably second are the patients that have an early response or a response on therapy through therapy but then relapse when therapy is discontinued. And they're considered difficult to treat, but not as difficult as the non-responders, the patients who never um, have their virus go away or eradicate the virus on therapy and remain positive. Those are really the most difficult to treat patients right now that, that we have. What we also found was that we could predict which patients were more likely to respond by looking at their virus level at week 12. So if their virus was undetectable at week 12, uh, and those patients were treated for the full 72 weeks, that their sustained response rate could be 57%. Is there anything, anything to offer to a non-responder at week 12? What you should do? What we, uh, no, we don't, and I, I think that's, that's probably one of the major holes in, in our therapy right now is patients who don't have a response at week 12. We know that continuing therapy is not going to be very helpful because only 4% will respond.